What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Critical Old Lord here. So I'm talking about how we end in this video here again today. We're going to talk about these four new cast members that I, I expect to start appearing and get announced officially at some point that seem to be locked for the upcoming movie Halloween Ends. And we'll also talk about this idea of how Michael Myers could potentially go out if he were to die just from something i've started to see online don't know if this is true or not or if this is even something that will actually happen on screen but jumping into these cast members one of the people who will be in halloween ends will be a actress named emily brinks she is going to be involved in some capacity she confirmed this herself over on instagram and i'll go into some details as to how she did that in the coming seconds the other person who will be in halloween ends is an actor named tyler Galant, I believe is how you pronounce his last name. Don't know what characters these two are going to be playing, but they seem to be locked in. Little, and I'll explain how in a second. And the other person will be a actor named Michael Barari. So these individuals, again, I don't know how they're going to be factored into the movie, what roles they'll be they'll be playing. But Emily, in particular, made this clear from her uh, comments over on Instagram, on her actual Instagram page, when she shared that she worked on the film she also mentioned rohan campbell so she confirmed his involvement and she basically responded to a comment to confirm that yes she was in the movie she talked about how she was kind of the stand-in for allison but she is a character in the movie as well so we'll see how she factors in and the other two i don't know but we at least know that she's confirmed that she's a character in the movie the other person i need to tell you about the last individual who i kind of touched on briefly in my other video is karan harris karan harris seems to be in this movie as well now the reason i believe these people are involved on top of emily herself just confirming it and outwardly saying this in a instagram comment on her instagram page the other three seem to be in the movie because if you go to the Rough House Pictures, I believe is them, the Rough House Pictures Instagram page where they have the post up celebrating the the ending of the production of Halloween Ends and looking forward to the future for the movie to release and all that good jazz while they go through post-production. The individuals that are commenting, if you look through there, you'll find those people. You'll find Karan Harris. You'll find Tyler. You'll find Michael Gallant. Uh, or Tyler Gallant, I meant to say, and then you'll see Michael Barari. So they're not outwardly saying, hey, we're in this movie, but you know, the interactions underneath that post would suggest that you are. And again, Michael Barari, not Michael Barari, um, Karan Harris was the individual who I was telling you maybe he's in charge of this booth, this type of radio tower that has to do with the radio tower and that significance. He kills somebody, Michael Myers kills somebody at, at a booth related to the radio tower and then it's broadcast over the air and that's how the whole town of Haddonfield will know that Michael Myers is back. Now, touch on to touch on what I think will happen potentially with Michael Myers, not what I think will happen, but just what I've started to see come online. So I guess if you don't want any possible spoilers, don't listen. But this idea of Michael Myers killing himself. Now, that's kind of laughable when you hear it out or just say it out loud. I'm just laughing in my head but at the same time maybe there's a chance that could come off well on screen but then of course there's a side of me that thinks you know that's really not how i would prefer michael myers to go and i guess the whole suicide thing would be how is he doing this is this in an act of laurie stroll luring him into something because then if that's the case that's different he wouldn't have direct well i mean in that case you're not directly committing suicide unless he of course i don't think michael myers is complete is a complete idiot uh if he's if there's a dire situation that laura strode has placed herself in and michael just opts to go to her then of course yes i guess you could say that that's committing suicide but not only did he commit suicide laura strode committed suicide maybe this will be something that is a payoff to the dialogue that again Lori has in halloween kills where she's talking about her and michael dying together and going into just like this dramatic monologue about it <laughs> with karen in the hospital so if that's how it happens then that will be a satisfying way to have michael myers commit suicide him and Lori dying together but if michael were to let's say because i i've seen people think about this that that last image or the image that we have for them on the rough house pictures instagram page where they're celebrating the end of production on halloween ends they're on a they're on a bridge it looks like so i've seen people speculate 
is this where the movie ends? Is the movie going to end with Michael Myers jumping off of a bridge? Now, in that instance, if that's how Michael Myers commits suicide, you I have to see how that comes on comes out on screen because I know the context of that will be important. But just hearing it out loud, saying it out loud, Michael Myers jumping off a bridge to kill himself. That sounds a little bit like you're trying to spark a fire in a certain region of the fandom i'll just say because i will i'll eventually let it go but depending on how it's depicted on screen i know that's not going to sit well with some people because it does sound kind of out of character as well this the shape physically climbing onto a bridge and then jumping off of it to kill themselves that sounds almost as ridiculous as the idea of what resurrection presented where michael got undressed swapped clothes with a paramedic he took all that time to do that versus just killing the paramedic you know and walking off into the ether he for some reason now cares that people know that he's dead or alive when in the past he's shown that he doesn't really care about that it just seems out of character for us to have this idea that he'll jump off a bridge but again it depends on how it's depicted on screen and how it how it comes off and how we ultimately get to that point if it feels like a random thing that doesn't connect to the narrative, then of course that would be something I could see starting a fire in a certain region of the fandom. But again, if if he's committing suicide, the suicide should be occurring between him and Lori in some type of final epic battle. That's just how I think most of us would prefer that. If you have decided that Michael Myers will commit suicide, the way Michael should commit suicide that I think would satisfy a lot of people would only be if he and Lori die together in a way in which he already understands that he's about to die. But this disdain that has grown in him towards Lori, maybe this is something that has just grown in between the events of Halloween 2018, Halloween Kills and Halloween Ends, that he just wants to risk it all to finally kill this individual. Maybe Lori actually uh does quite does a lot of damage to michael in this movie that ultimately just gets under his skin and of course the time frame between this and halloween ends is a lot more believable for michael to develop a grudge against the woman versus halloween 1978 and the 2018 film in itself because that 40 year mark the only person concerned with that was lori <laughs> but let me know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below if you haven't already of course make sure you subscribe turn on post notification and miss a video in the description i have links to my social media accounts my facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there of course to let me know if there's any movies news or reviews you would like me to cover in the future with all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.